Oh, I love it. So I moved here to film because um, I was in every scene and I had, I had to work on Sundays. So me, my husband and my little boy, who was two and a half, um, we rented a farmhouse here. So I really immersed myself. We got to look out on that beautiful scenery. And um, anyone who watches Gentleman Jack will see that Halifax itself is a character because it's so dramatic. Yeah, it's beautiful. I'm just thrilled that we are bringing um, her uh, to a, a prime time audience, um, you know, at nine o'clock on BBC and already out in H uh, HBO in uh, America, because people should know about her. She's, there's so much to know about this woman. She's, was, she's unique, she was transgressive. She's epic in so many ways. And of course, then the secret part of the diary um, is mind-blowing for the LGBTQIA community and for, for everyone um, to know about her. But yeah, she's, it's an honor, a real honor. So my first agency was in Halifax at Dean Club Mill. Um, and one of my first auditions was at Eureka with Johnny Ball. Um, so and I'm, I live in um, at, near Oldham, so I'm like half an hour away anyway. So we used to do day trips here. So it, this is, this. It's not, Halifax isn't new to me, it's always been in my life, yeah. She's got so much energy and she's so um, amazingly um, intelligent and um, so it, it yeah, I, I think it, it's, it's the most challenging role I've ever played but um, the most fulfilling. It was, it was a nutter joy. Come to Shipton Hall, you have to come to Shipton Hall, it's beautiful. I had lots of family days out there, it's got, um, I'm going to do my tourist bit but I actually believe this. You can go and visit the hall and then it's, there's a playground and a park and um, a boating lake and a land train and a little rail train so it's the best day out. It's wonderful filming in Halifax, I mean I've filmed here quite a lot now as you know and uh, it's always a good experience, it's always um, uh, just very rewarding. Uh, the, the landscape is so photogenic. I love I love uh, Calderdale and Halifax. I think it's every time I um, I, I live up here half of the time now, but I, I live half the time in Oxford and half the time in Halifax. And um, I, I grew up here, and I couldn't wait to get away as a kid. Uh, I wanted to go and live in London, but it was when I discovered Anne Lister actually that Halifax became uh, magical to me, and I wanted to come back. Um, what you can expect from Gentleman Jack is a portrait of an extraordinary human being who we really all should be celebrating and who we all should be a lot more aware of and we should all be a lot more aware of um, her brilliant writing. Why wait to come to Shibden and call the death? I, I, I hope people, people should come. I mean, look at this place. It's just, there's so much to see in Halifax. It's such a rich, it's a wonderful place.